What's happening? And welcome, appreciate y'all for joining the player. I'm Willie Williams. I'm saying, hey, sugar. I'm coming in from um St. Louis, Missouri. Pastor Will on the line, let the chat say, hey, man, I done lost a little bit of my voice, so y'all gonna have to bear with a player. You say, these women, yeah. Say another one, the three, two, three. 313 Sugars in the building. Texas checking on in. Mill Millington, Tennessee is in the building. Say, hey, Nina. I see you. Appreciate y'all for coming on in here. Remember to click that thumbs up as you do it. Say hello from the Bay Area. Baltimore is in the building. Hey, mans. Uh -uh. <clears throat> Say hey, checking in from Philly. Say hey, sexy. That's what's up. Say hey, sugar. Youngstown, Ohio is in the house. H Town is in the building. Hey, sugar. My throat is killing me right now. I appreciate y'all for being here. Appreciate what y'all do. Listen, in case you're new around here, I got a whole bunch of channels on YouTube that y'all need to be subscribed to because ain't no telling what YouTube gonna be around here doing. They gonna try to drop a player off. That's right, 30 minutes of fire is what we're gonna try to do around here get you in and out because y'all got um things to do people to do that's what i'm trying to do around here Augusta jones i made on in here tuscaloosa alabama's in the building portland loves you willie love you back say i still sound good i appreciate that right there tuxin pronounced tucson arizona is in the house i say tuxin is it tuxin don't even worry about it. Say, hey, from the ATL, Georgia's in the building. Say, Sacktown in the building. Say, checking in from Eulis, Eulis, Texas. Say, hey, Willie. Hey, sugar. That's what's up. Say, ready for the instructions play. I'll say, what up, big pepper Willie, the 909, checking in for the good word. Y'all know I got one for y'all. Say, did you do too much on STD Friday? <laughs> Listen. <laughs> When we be, it does affect us. Listen, you got to go down there, get your medication. Like I be trying to go out on the tell people so we can go out on and clear that on up. I didn't take all of it. Got some in the medicine cabinet. That's what's up. They got the 2 for the 25 STD special. Yeah. Baton Rouge is in the building. What's happening? The 503 is showing out. Gainesville, Florida is in the house. All right, now. He say, I cannot wait till you get your own comedy show. I'm trying. Listen, man. Somebody reach out to Tyler Perry or something because he got his own studio. You know what I'm saying? I'm in Florida, Atlanta right there. It's nothing. It's an hour and 47, an hour and 23 minutes. To get to the ATL, fuck it. I fly spirit. Don't even worry about it. I'm trying to do what I can do to be the best that I can be. I appreciate that. Yes, I do say, hey, Willie Sugar. PA checking in. Say, what's up from Alabama? Charlotte, North Carolina is in the house. That's what's up. Appreciate y'all, man. You say you need some honey and tea for that throat, Willie, but you still... But we still love you, sugar. I appreciate that. I'm trying to sip. I'm fucking around, drink coffee. This shit ain't cute. Uh -uh. Net Netflix is slipping on pimping. I'm trying to tell you, yeah, yeah, because I got some things to say. <laughs> if they ever give me a chance, all I want is a chance out here. Shout out to Dolo for show though for the five dollar cash app. Say watch out for that car. Yeah, you gotta watch twenty three sixty nine players. Be careful out here. You can't be out here fang dangling within ten miles of your goddamn radius. Oh yeah, it's fucking around to be in that domestic love. That's the best relationships. Remember, I am a relationship expert. 99% of my relationships have failed. And one thing I can say, a domestic love relationship is one of the best you can be in. I'm trying to tell you, if a bitch ain't trying to knock your ass off, you really ain't, you really ain't doing that. You really ain't putting down, say, at Tyler Perry, get past the will of his own show. I appreciate that right there. I hope Tyler going on to see this. Hell, I don't watch all your movies. I don't support all your plays. Just saying. Give back to the community. <laughs> That's what's up. Say, so sound like your STD Friday was solid. Yes, it was. Listen, all ah, flim flam and shit. You know, I've been hawking and shit. Man, this thing ain't cute out here. The 919 is in the building. Appreciate that. Say, Lynette. Lynette from Philly. Hey, Willie. Hey, Lynette. What's happening? Appreciate y'all. Say, start a podcast. Listen, I don't know the difference in live streaming and podcasting. Ain't it all like the same? Well, I know you take the audio and you put it up on one, <clears throat> one of like the other systems and shit like that right there. And oh, no, you put the audio. You can do. You can put it to iTunes and all that fly stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
I just ain't got the time. This is, listen, got a lot going on. Say, hey, Willie, the 315 Syracuse, New York is in this mother. What's happening? Say, if she haven't hit you with an iron skillet or hit you with some hot grit, she don't love you. I'm trying to tell you, man. Y'all, y'all around here with that fake bougie love out here. That's, that's old shit. Mick. Mixed cloud. Let me go ahead on and write that, that down. Possibly I could be able to look into it because um, time time is real limited. And is they paying over there? <laughs> is they giving ads and shit? You know what I'm saying? Say hey, sugar, Mississippi in the building. That's what's up. Say hey, chocolate sugar, love from the 919 in the building. Say everyone here, tag Tyler Perry. Please tag Tyler. Tyler. Dial, I got churn to feed and shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I got range. I can do stuff. I can read a script, which I ain't never read a script, but I can read because I can read. <laughs> I think it's simple, but it ain't because it takes work, and I'm one who is willing to put in the work. Tyler, hell, I'm in the interview right now, Tyler. How you doing? I'm Willie Williams. <laughs> All the way out of Florida. Stay in your ground state. Bust a bitch, go home state. Please don't run up state. <laughs> Cause I'm in fifth of my life, Tyler. How would you want me to 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 perform? What you want me to be like the president in the movie, be like a pimp player, you know what I'm saying? Or be like a pastor. <laughs> you know, regular shit. Should I do any goddamn way? You know what I'm saying? You want me to be like chief police or mayor or something? I can use big words and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Just look at all my work on YouTube, Tyler. <laughs> I'm just saying. I appreciate y'all, boy. I showed up, dude. Look, 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 look. Say no script. Will it be your own, your 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 original self, the best comedy ever? Yeah, I can't. It, listen, it's hard for me to act like other people. <laughs> this shit difficult. <laughs> it really is. See, I'm a natural. So I man, I really do appreciate it. I just be just saying stuff. <laughs> I don't even be thinking all the time. Let me go on and show y'all something. Because I saw some. Sometimes we waste a lot of time with one another trying to get to know each other, just trying to have basic conversation with one another. Sometimes we're trying to hook up. Sometimes we just trying to exchange our thoughts, but typically, ty but pfft, something went wrong. Let's say, but typically, when penises is talking to vaginas, we trying to get something. Like, let, let's, let's not, come on now. We grown around here. <laughs> mm -mm. I don't know about to play like that. But if, cause, unless we talking business, then I, all right, but hell, we still trying to hit. Just saying, I'm trying to help y'all out with real life on, on, on earth stuff, you know. Y'all click that thumbs up, I appreciate that. Then what's up, Uncle Willie? For, um, for, Foresight George is in the building. Hope all is well on your end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Player chilling. You already know me. That's what's up. Shout out to Dolo for show though for the five dollar cash app again. Say another five for YouTube not giving me my notification. That's what's up. Shout out to YouTube for playing. Hating on a player. Say all of the things you say in your facial expressions. Thank you for your page. You're welcome. I appreciate y'all. Listen, we, 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 we don't care. We play too much. But I like people to be honest. Honesty sometimes is the best policy. Not always. Let's not do that. <laughs> Depends on your situation. It's not always the best, but I had to saw this right here. It's something real quick, and one time I uh, one thing I don't like to do is waste people time. Shout out to Mr. Milkman I made on in the building. What's happening? So your Wi-Fi tripping? Tap it, tap that muff. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you got to correct or reboot. Reboot your DSL. What the hell? They is getting it in. Oh, that's an old one, but I might have to do that when they get. Shout out to Tasha for the three ninety nine super chat. I appreciate you, sugar. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Let me show y'all. Oh, damn, it popped up on my time. But let me show y'all what I'm talking about. We got to start wasting time out here with people because time is something we can't get back. Money, we can get that back. You know what I'm saying? A broad or a player, you, we can typically get that back. Or we can try to get it back. If not, you're just banging the closest thing to them. You know what I'm saying? But look and listen to this little quick 32-second conversation. 
Watch what I'm saying. So I got a sprained neck, shoulder, and arm. Well, there goes your sex life. What? You can't give him no neck. That was never an issue. All right. No, no I mean, like, I don't give it, so. You don't? No. You don't give it? No. no. I'm about to talk to you later on. You got to go. You got to go. You are so negative. Ooh, I cannot deal with this negativity right now. So I got a spring. I do appreciate player. Player say, you so negative. I can't deal with this negativity right now. What you mean you don't get fellatio? We grown on earth. Teenagers giving fellatio. What the fuck you talking about? Oh, you special. Baby, they... They is sucking meats in elementary. What, what, what? Yeah, yeah, the shit negative. Ain't nobody got time for them type of conversations. Look, 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 look. Watch it. Let's do it again. So I got a sprained neck, shoulder, and arm. Well, there goes your sex life. What? You can't give him no neck. <laughs> it ain't nothing wrong with your mouth, sugar. You talking about a sprained neck, shoulder, and all that shit. I got time for that shit. What you mean you can't put it in your mouth? I, 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 I don't understand that. Bitch, they don't even make virgins no more. What the fuck is we talking about? This is a waste of time even speaking to you. But she thought it was cute. Oh, no, that's not an issue because I don't even do that anyway. Bitch, get out of my line. Ain't nobody time for you stupid motherfuckers. Look, look, look. That was never an issue. All right. No, no I mean, like, I don't give it, so. You don't? No. You don't give it? No. no. I'm about to talk to you later. Oh, you got to go. Ooh. You got to go. You are so negative. That is so negative. That's what's up. Nobody got time for that dumb shit. Why is we even speaking? What is what? What else is there to talk about? How your day was? Ain't nobody got time for that stupid shit. No, 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 no. Listen, we can talk about the topics of the day and all that black shit, but like a real, real conversation, that, that shit negative, baby. Say she might prefer that monkey in her face. That might be what it is. Nah, nah, nah. I didn't think about it in the beginning, but she might like a little monkey. She might like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but sometimes you can get a real big clitoris. Shout out to the babies out there with that big clitoris. <laughs> they say that y'all have a lot of damn fun. It's hard for y'all to walk around without climaxing. I'm saying it must be a blessing. Shout out to Jamodi. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Don't mean to mess it up. Jamodi. Jamodi. For the $5 super chat. Appreciate you. Say, keep it up. I'm trying. Say, hey, sugar. Say, all she got to do is open up and homeboy can do some pumping. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> Say, yeah, ain't nothing like that meat. I'm trying to tell you. Baby talking about she on, dude. Listen. Unless she LGBT, there's nothing for. I can't stand negative people. <laughs> I'm gonna listen to the dumb shit one, one more again, and we out of here. So I got a sprained neck, shoulder, and arm. Well, that goes your sex life. What? You can't give him no neck. <laughs> that was never an issue. All right. No, I mean like I don't give it. So you don't. No. You don't give it? No. no. I'm about to talk to you later. Oh, you got to go. Ooh. You got to go. You are so negative. I've been so negative. Get the hell on. Ladies, let me explain it to you. If you ain't giving no mouthpieces, if you're not using both money makers, you're useless. Bitch. What, is, what, is we, what is we doing? Why is we around here playing? And then, and then somebody like that, We'll start a relationship and have a man and all that fly shit and then be surprised that he got caught getting hit in the parking lot. What the fuck? You useless. What can you do? Cook? Bitch, I can cook. What, what, what is we doing? I can't give my own self no head so Bitch, I need somebody else to help me out. You know what I'm saying? The fuck you around me for and you can't do regular shit. That, 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 that's like breathing. Ladies, ain't <laughs> ain't that's like breathing. Like once y'all get like a certain age, like twelve, you already know how to do it. Nah, thir 
14, 15, 17, 8 to 20. All right, 20, 20. Y'all already like a pro. You know what I'm saying? She don't get no MVP. play. Who, 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 who the fuck is you? Is you? <laughs> he is nobody. <laughs> so I'm just saying, players, watch out for babies like that in the community just talking, the, talking that negative shit about things that they don't do in real life. Ain't, ain't, ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> Say no head, no seconds. I'm trying to tell you, cut a bitch shot. Cut a bitch shot. Hang your phone up. Say she needs some milk. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody ain't had done did her right. You got to catch that bit. That when she sleep. <laughs> I'm just saying, if y'all together is not sexual abuse, I'm just saying. A lot of people say, well, well, if you put the penis in her mouth while she's sleeping, she haven't consented. <laughs> I don't even know how to play that shit. But listen, you know, I already gave up that monkey and we in here sleep. A lot of y'all like to climb on the player and put your cooch all in the player mouth while player sleep, sleep that shit musty. I'm just saying, y'all, y'all got to be careful. Like, <laughs> we got to stay safe. <laughs> Say, no, head, I'm not down with that. I'm trying, who the fuck, who playing like this? I didn't even know people like that exist no more 2020. Just because her neck hurt, her mouth ain't hurt. I'm trying to take, there's no excuse. What, is that have to do with like her religious beliefs or something? Mm. Yeah, that monkey, listen, that monkey get musty. Listen, a lot of y'all around here with that musty monkey, I ain't saying that it's all bad because listen, there is different type of must, musties now. Listen, you could have been outside playing and working and all that shit right there and you done been down in the sun and you come back in but you ain't wash up but the player trying to hit, you know what I'm saying? It's a little musty. Ain't nothing wrong with it. A lot of y'all like to have these goddamn mores. Wait, wait, wait. Let me go bathe first. Let me go take a dump first. Bitch, shut now. No. I got time for that shit. Spontaneous. Bitch. I got a poop. Bitch, poop. The fuck? What are we talking about? Y'all can fuck up a moment by changing the moment. You need to be taught properly. Say it's not you, it's me, baby. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. For real though, man. People, we got to grow up, y'all. We truly got to grow up. We got to do better with our lives. We is wasting time trying to always be clean. <laughs> I'm just saying. Shout out to the players who be still giving karma leans after she done took a dump and didn't have baby wipes. She just wiped with toilet paper. Shout out ourselves out. That's what's up. High five. Everybody. Yeah. Nah. Nah. Say no head like a DVD salesman. Obsolete. There it is. <laughs> Say they killed me with that. Want something but don't want to give it. Gotta go. Try and tell you. Say one time for the 954 in the building. That's what's up. Listen. Y'all click that like button as you come on in. If you'd like to support the machine. Got the cash out. Willie Williams show. We got the Patriot. Damn it. I said the Patreon. We got the PayPal link. The donation link in the description. If you like to do it like that. If not. Everybody just click the thumbs up button. Man. Let's just let other people know that we in here. Cause we finna try to go on and get in. Now I got about 10 more minutes. Let's see what we can do. The title of the show is A Pretty Woman talks about dating i say a white supremacist but i am gonna change it to what she called it was um a racist she 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 used the term racist the 225 saint francisville louisiana willie you are my mentor of the year 2020 speaking instructions and corrections love you willie love you back appreciate you sugar say put it on the shirt hashtag <laughs> us too <laughs> i'm trying to tell you there it is say hey my brother can you reply can, can you replay oh i'm finna play it right now look look, look watch it watch it, watch it i'm finna play this sugar she finna tell us a story sometimes we gotta listen to the baby's talk i, 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 I I know, I know, I know, I know. I be saying sometimes you can't let it be yourself. But damn it, you got to listen to the babies and really see what's going on in their life. Because everybody done been through what is um, um, called the trials and the tribulations of life. Nobody is exempt. You know what I'm saying? No one is exempt. It is what it is. So let's listen to the sugar. 
A little background, I've known for five years. I've been out in California for the past four years, going to college, getting my degree. I recently moved back and I reconnected with him and we started hanging out a lot. I would just go over to his house, we would chill, watch movies, drink, just hang out. Everybody's saying there must have been signs or she had to know he was racist. No, there weren't and no, I didn't. If I knew he was racist, I would not be talking to him or hanging out with him. Why, 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 why do we gotta, why we can't talk to people who we deem as racist if they're not being like violent towards us or something? I don't, I don't, I don't understand. I know some racist people that I'm cool with. I know, that's hard to hear, ain't it? I know some racist people that I'm actually cool with. They just don't like my color. It's okay. It's all right. As long as nobody's trying to violate you, hurt you in any shape, form, or fashion, if it's just a conversation, we can have a conversation. There's people that you work with that don't like your skin color. There's people that's in your building, that's in your grocery store, that between your legs, that don't like the color of your skin. There are some people you done hunched that don't like the color of your skin. I really don't see the problem. But we'll let her tell a story. Come on, sugar. Honestly, if it went for those texts, I would have never known he was racist just because he hit it so well. So the night I found out he was racist was the day after Memorial Day. It was the day George Floyd's murder was broadcast all over social media. I was really upset about it. And when I went over to his house that night, I was venting about it. That led us to get... I'm going to stop that right there. I have been asked a question in the comment section. Say, I don't understand why you and Tommy Sotomayor talk trash about black women, but think we supposed to march for y'all. And the next one was, how about that? Um, Listen, when we die, <laughs> we dead. <laughs> Marching don't do shit for us. And I don't, I don't talk trash about our doggy who's sisters. Why would I do that? No. I support the... <laughs> I support the good, the good single mamas. Everybody in the comment section know that I support the good single mamas. You know, the ones that educate their children very well. You know, the ones that let the kids do what they want to do and stuff. The one that bring the new boyfriends around the children. The one that don't let their daddies be in the child life. Hashtag no daddies. Oh, I don't talk trash about people. Just call it for what it is. You know, a lot of times we say, um, niggas ain't shit. I agree. <laughs> These bitches ain't shit. You should agree. Just saying. And bitches is not just. Listen, 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 listen. Bitches and hoes and sluts. I respect all of them. But that's not just the color. We speak it as female. Just like when y'all say nigga, it typically, when I was coming up, it's not just a black dude that was male. So uh, I don't I don't know like whether you're new around here, but um, fuck them old. Fuck them supposed to be, who is you? Appreciate the comment though, here we go. <laughs> Wait, I gotta back it up a little bit because I lost a spot, my bad. <laughs> so the night I found out he was racist was the day after Memorial Day. It was the day George Floyd's murder was broadcast all over social media. I was really upset about it, and when I went over to his house that night, I was venting about it. That led us to get into a debate about All Lives Matter versus Black Lives Matter. It's a debate he was referring to in the text messages that I posted. So during this debate, I was just explaining to him that Black Lives Matter too. Black lives are the ones being oppressed. We acknowledge that All Lives Matter, but we're just trying to... A dog of you people being depressed on earth, like in 2020, like, 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 really? Can, can somebody write in the comment section if we being oppressed in 2020? Cause I got like a cell phone. I don't, I, I can, I can drink from all the water. Do y'all know that they ain't even got water fountains no more? <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, that's all I'm doing is speaking the truth. <laughs> Listen, are we really being depressed? Oppress is and one of y'all out here being oppressed by a lot of you brothers and sisters. I don't, I don't know, like, like I don't see it. I will always say that that's doing a disservice to our mama them, our grandmama them, our ancestor them. For us to call it oppression, but mm, you got the right to speak. Here we go. And get everybody to realize that black lives matter as well as everybody else's lives. We got to stop trying to get everybody to recognize that darker you people life matter. 
Go to Chicago. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Go to any upscale community. You tell me if, if we think black lives matter. The problem is we think, we don't think black, we don't take shit serious. Come on, man. You say, Ron, I hate them too. Oh, cool. That's what's up. You say this brought this joke. <laughs> yeah. This is crazy. Why do we need other people to, well, I think everyone should have, the humans' lives matter. I think that that's a good thing. I understand where the term black lives matter come from. I get it, but it's been co-opted. That shit ain't what it is. Please read the mission statement. Please do that right there, because they ain't for darker hue, heterosexual males and or females. Reading ain't illegal. I'm trying to tell you. You better have to read this shit before they make it illegal. <laughs> I got really frustrated with him and I basically told him to leave me alone. She got frustrated with a player because he said all lives matter and she trying to make him understand and feel that black lives matter and shit. Baby, everybody don't like you. I just... How you get frustrated with somebody that they don't... They don't accept what you saying, basically. They don't agree with you. Now, I, I don't want to talk to you anymore. <laughs> and he tried to make it up for me, for me to drink, and we continued with our night. As we continued with our night, we were drinking, listening to music on Spotify. He had given me his password because I was on the aux on his phone. So I did the thing where you like double tap a person's phone to get um, all their apps up, and I saw the messages on his Twitter. So in my head, I'm just like, note it, I'm gonna go back to that later. So as the night progressed, we were drinking more and more. He was getting more and more drunk. And the more drunk he gets, the more like angry he gets. And me and him got in an argument. Couldn't tell you what it was about, because we were just both drunk. But I know he was being extremely rageful. And he was throwing shit around the apartment, cussing, screaming my name. And then I went inside and I hid inside of his bathroom from him. He was yelling my name to come out, but he was like really drunk and like stumbling around. And I just hid in there for about 15 minutes and eventually he passed out. So when he passed out, I got out of the bathroom and I grabbed his phone and I went to the messages. So obviously I saw the first message from that night and then I saw the messages from previous nights where he stated that he wanted to call me the N-word. His grandfather would have owned me and whipped me. She went back and read some messages. And he said in the messages that he had been wanting to call you the N-word. <laughs> How was your behavior? <laughs> no, listen. How was your behavior when when he typed that he been wanting to call you a negro? And if it were back in the day, his granddad or great granddaddy would have had you as a slave. <laughs> Sound like a fact. <laughs> I don't know. Listen. It's not in our face, but it's not equal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he wanted to abuse me and make me a statistic. He wanted to abuse you and make you a statistic. What do you mean, sexually? A lot of y'all like, like a little bit of that rough stuff now. I'm trying to tell you. A lot of y'all like to be choked and gagged, you know, bagged and gagged sometimes. Tied up, put in the garbage bag. Some of y'all like that fly shit. So is that what she talking about? Mm-hmm. Say she like him, he like her. Yeah. That listen, there is a lot of things that we may we want to say to people in a moment of anger. A lot of times we do. A lot of times you will not call your woman a bitch. But sometimes you want to. I don't mean you hate her. Because you want to call your woman a nigga. That don't mean you hate her. Just depend on your damn behavior. Say Black Lives Matter funded by George Soros. Yeah, that's what they say. You say the baby line. <laughs> and it was just like really hurtful because he was somebody that I genuinely cared for. You wanted that meat, sugar. That's the truth. And you didn't know that. He wanted to call you a nigga and his granddaddy would have had you as a slave, which is true if his granddaddy or great granddaddy was a slave owner. If like you was around, but you would have had to 
wear like your real hair, sugar. You couldn't have had long, flowing, silky, wavy and shit that looked like got a little shine to it. All right, all right. That's what's up. So I eventually left his apartment because I didn't feel safe anymore after seeing those messages. But I took his phone with me because I was still going through it. I just didn't want him to wake up and like me still be there because I was actually genuinely afraid. So I went outside the apartment in my car and I just started going through this one more just to see like if there was more stuff he was saying about me or if there you were generally scared, but you went outside in your car to go through his phone. I understand why you wanted to continue to go through the phone to see what other things that 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 may discourage you from getting that meat. But you stayed in the parking lot and you was generally afraid. Afraid would have meant you left a player phone there and took your little hot at home. If you really afraid, sugar. Or hell, left with his phone. <laughs> I'm just saying. It was just like more stuff I could find because I knew like this was the last time I was going to talk to him. So I just wanted to see like what I could find just to give myself some closure. So I didn't sleep that night at all. Like I had his phone from like 2 to 5 a.m. maybe. And that's when I posted the tweet. It was around 5 a.m. He reached out to me around 8 a.m. saying he needed his phone and he could explain the whole conversation. Unless he got two phones, how did he reach out to you and tell you that he needed his phone? How did he know that you had his phone? Did he have an Apple? <laughs> did he have tracking on his phone? I don't, I don't know. Shout out to Donovan for the $25 cash app. Appreciate you pimping. Yes, I do. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see if he got the phone back. I didn't think he was going to be up already, and I still had his phone. So at this point, I was trying to figure out how I would return his phone to him without seeing him. So I ended up just going back to his apartment and leaving his phone and the spare key he gave me in his parking spot. You, y'all had a key. Girl, you already been getting at me. Because I generally care for him. Y'all was hunching. Can we just be honest? He <laughs> said, bitch, shut up. You need a whooping. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm telling you. Shout out to Robain for the five dollar super chat. Appreciate you. Say so maybe he got a computer. Well, yeah, yeah, like with the Apple phones, you can like track your phone and all that stuff through the iCloud and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. All right, so just a few updates from after everything happened he had reached out to me like as soon as i left his house you know blowing up my phone just telling me like you know this is serious data i need you to call me my family's in danger people are threatening me people are banging on my door like and i'm just like i know it's serious the words that you spoke about me are serious so you mean to tell me you saw the words that he had untyped a few nights ago or the night before that saying you the N word and my granddaddy, daddy, daddy, daddy would have had your ass in shackles. You put it out to the internet. Now his life in danger. He need for you to respond to him so he can try to clear some things up, sugar. You put his life in danger. Tell her Stanley Earl say, come on back to the dark side. Yeah, that monkey Moise. Come on, she she's so hurt, that thing Moise. Trying to tell you. Anyway, since then, he's given me like this BS apology. Um, didn't believe anything he said because I'm pretty sure he's a sociopath. You don't believe anything he said, but you believe everything that he typed. <laughs> you know what do? Listen, just, just let him talk. We tend to not want to believe people when we don't want to believe people. I think that that's human nature. It's something about us as human. When we mad at a motherfucker or something, I don't believe none of that shit you said, but that shit that you said before, I was upset or feeling some kind of way about you. I believed you. Say the dog or the berry, the sweet of the juice. He just wanted that sweet stuff. I'm trying, listen, listen. If y'all think she ain't go back and get that meat. Oh, 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 oh. Confusion is, <laughs> confusion is a mother, yeah, it is. And a narcissist, not exaggerating. I'm pretty sure I've seen him outside my house. Um, you call him a narcissistic or narcissist? That hot. I hope you know the definition, sugar, because y'all just be throwing out these goddamn words, you know, because you've been to college, you're educated, you know what I'm saying, you got the degree. All right, uh, I'm educated too. Been to multiple colleges, never graduated, smart enough to go to more than one, so I ain't got to have student debt like you. 
But we just be throwing out these words. Oh no. You say the weave a little dry, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot the point that that in this one, the first video the shit looked it like it had done had some mousse on it or like some cold water on or something. You know what I'm saying? Just had that shine. But now your shit dry. Mm -mm. Work on it. He knows where I live now, and I never told him where I live. So that had me, has had me scared for the past few weeks. I got a protective order against him that explains literally everything. The judge granted it, but then he contested it. So now we have to go to court. That's it. He found out where you live. <laughs> And somebody said, that monkey probably good. Yeah. Yeah, that monkey probably good. Yeah, it said, narcissist equal her. H-E-R. Yeah, it is. <laughs> say, then he started crying and said he was sorry, so I forgave him, and now we getting married, and then I'm pregnant. <laughs> Listen, she done put a restraining order on that meat that she want. I, I can't take y'all serious. Say hey, sugar. Watching all the way from Dallas, Texas. Appreciate y'all being here. Mm mm mm. Say for what? Just don't talk to him no more. Yeah. Say her hair dry because she said she hurt. Her hurt. But I like her tone. I like her tone. Her she stayed in a monotone. She didn't holler. She didn't scream. She didn't get all. You know what I'm saying? Good woman is shown as I in this street. She sound genuine, genuinely big word hurt at him that she lost a good piece of meat. Say go to court. I know that thing. Moist not listen, especially when she get in court and look at what she used to get. <laughs> she want daddy meat. <laughs> She's so sad about her white daddy. Yeah. Say he done talked himself out of out of the monkey privilege. <laughs> you know, fucked up and left his phone open. What the fuck? Players gotta tighten up. Be careful. Don't be writing derogatory stuff like my granddaddy would have had you as a slave, even though it's true. If your granddaddy or great granddaddy was a slave owner and she was around, yeah. Hell, granddaddy would have been getting that monkey. <laughs> The ATL is in the house. Say so your show is so so real. One love. Appreciate you. Love you back, man. I appreciate y'all for being around here. Listen, we never know who we is getting ourselves involved in because we pay attention to the aesthetics. Big word. Our eyes do the thing. And then we deal with people. We start hunching and stuff. And then, you know, we start going together. It ain't like we said, okay, we together. No. No, nah, because we hunching and we done chill a little bit and had a few drinks, done smoked a little bit and snort a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Done shot up a little bit because we hang around each other. We together. All right, cool. You never really know people. You never really know it. She said that she didn't know that he was a racist. It took the George Floyd incident for her to realize that he was racist. But he likes you. He was dealing with you. One thing the millenniums do not understand what a real racist is, a real racist person, really, 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 really. Like that deep South real racist. That, listen, that back in the day racist, you couldn't even work, a, a, a racist wouldn't even work with you. Yep, YouTube playing with a notification. We had 400 likes yesterday, and they are your bullshit. Say, hey, my salt and pepper fixed brown sugar. Oh, that's what's up. Appreciate you. Say, that's a lie. She knew. Yeah, come on now. They done had too many conversations while she been getting that meat. Y'all babies got to stop doing that right there. Say if Ike Turner was a lie, shit would be different. I'm trying to tell you. got to start open handing him over. Just saying, say my ancestry from Missouri is bound to have a few races. It never occurred to me until now. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. Listen, a lot of um, colored folk had slaves also. <laughs> say hello, Chocolate Willie D from Illinois. I appreciate you for being here. 
Just stay from around like the south side of Chicago and shit. Cause they knock people off. Retaliation is a must and all that fly shit right there. So be careful and rest in peace to FB, FBG. He was a legend. Y'all be careful out there in the goddamn street. Grab your kids. It's, well, if you care about them, let them go outside. That was up. Say, hey, Willie, showing you some love from Carrollton, Alabama. Yeah, that's what's up. He said, can she hashtag Me Too him? Mm -hmm. But it ain't going to work. The Me Too movement is only for people who got real paper and or status. Real paper and or status. Saying Ike was innocent. I'm with Ike. Say, hey, oh, sugar. Say, I'm on CPT. <laughs> yeah. But it ain't your fault. It got something to do with YouTube because they're out here faking. Say, Willie, he has selective racism in him. She just needed some salt in her sugar. Yeah, that, listen, listen, listen. A real racist back in the day would not even deal with nobody. My, my hue. They ain't fuck with us like that. Real racist. Like you say, he could be a selective racist. Baby, he was probably sucking on you and hunching on you. He just didn't like them other niggas. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> you was good enough for him to hunch, baby. Damn. Y'all ain't got to be so uptight about all of this. Hell, you got color folk don't like color folk. Is that racist? I don't know. Shout out to Angela for the $10 cash out. Say, hey, sugar. Appreciate you. Yes, I do. Say, y'all ain't nothing without David Ruffin, okay? <laughs> Shout out to David Ruffin. <laughs> yeah. Say, gather her black Twitter. Uh-oh. This is strange. Say, um... Indian or Indian in, Indian color folk has slaves still got slaves in the hard rock casinos in Florida I heard I heard that too listen it's a whole bunch of us that's actually still slaves because if if you got any debt you if a, you is a slave to the lender the people you living with don't like you <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. So listen, sugar, y'all could have worked that out. Y'all could have worked that out, baby. Stop, stop letting these relationships go so easy. And we gotta work through anything. We can fuss, fight, shoot at each other, stab a bit, run, run a bitch over, kill you, bring you back to life. Cheat on you, bring your S C D, get pregnant by somebody else. God damn it, they work through some shit. You know what I'm saying? That's that real domestic love, baby. And you was in a real domestic love relationship. Be so quick to run. But then you call yourself strong. You been dealing with so-called racists before you find out he was a racist. Your relationship was fine, wasn't it? But you wanna be nosy. You want a little nose ass bitch. Listen, 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 if you wouldn't have been looking, bitch. <laughs> Y'all still been hunching. <laughs> Say the KKK probably finance your bins. I'm trying to tell you. Appreciate the KKK. <laughs> I'm telling you something. We got to let things go. Stop being so uptight. I'm pretty sure everybody's job is somebody don't like you. It's all right. Life goes on. Again, as long as no one out here is trying to harm you, let people live. Let people be what they want to be. Say, my cousin have a white man, and when we have a barbecue, he leave. He don't like you, niggas. That's what's up. Hey, at least he ain't phony about it. The only nigger that he like is your cousin. You got to respect that. We like who we like, man. <laughs> we really like who we like, for real. <laughs> Say, I'm a slave to Sally Mae. She's a real gangster. Oh, yeah, yeah. You can't even write that bitch off. <laughs> you can't even get that shit back to the government. It's a problem. You know what I'm saying? So, I just want y'all to watch 23689. Just make sure that you ain't getting put in the body bag. You can be shot, stabbed, and all that fly shit, but as long as you live. 
You can still love that person to be with that person. You just know what not to do next time. That made that person do them type of things to you. See, everything is a learning process. Say she's just the bigot. <laughs> Say the blood races to the Crips. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Show the film. Say I don't like colors or sartine. <laughs> Saltines. You say your boss don't like you. He just filled his quota. I'm trying to tell you. Say two blacks in the house, he's gone. <laughs> that means too many niggas in here. Just shit. Now nah, enough is enough. There's too much color in the house. <laughs> you gotta respect that shit. Hey, Toa. <laughs> I don't even get mad at folk no more. I remember a while back somebody had called me a nigger. I just laughed. You thought that shit was gonna hurt me. You need a hug. You, you wanna hug it out? <laughs> fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. You sure you don't wanna hug? Come on, come on. Come on, let's hug that. Motherfucker left. <laughs> Cause l listen, shit funny to me. Cause I'm in Florida. This ain't ground state. But a bitch go home state. Please don't run up. I'm in fear for my life. I'm scared. Let people talk. Don't get stuff all worked up. Say he's not leaving because of racism. He's leaving because us black people get full and drunk and be ready to fight. <laughs> we now that demo, we will have an event. <laughs> get no up. You fuck around and renege in the space game, bitch. You damn near get shot. I'm trying to tell you. Now you got to be careful. <clears throat> Say, called another live. Say, hey, sugar. Dallas, Texas in the building. What's happening? <laughs> Say, I hug you. Well, I hug you back, sugar. There it is. The 504 Trump love. There it is. Hashtag LOL. All right now. Mm hmm. He said, I'm gonna miss be my boss. Oh, say, I'm gonna be my boss. Massa, there it is. We should all strive to be a massa. A boss. Upper management. Leaders. <laughs> Just. Floor Park, NYC. He'll say, hey, sugar. Number nine, Yaki racist. <laughs> and she, it's, this is that a cackalon. <laughs> that baby had a cackalon. And, uh, sold in, man. You know what I'm saying? But um, listen. Say, I'm, I'm in Alabama. Another stand your ground state. I understand. I'm, 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 listen, I'm scared. I'm scary. I don't start nothing. We can hug it out. I'm going to run from the situation. Because I don't care how hard you is on earth. When you die, you dead. Take your hard shit with you. Just saying. Well, if someone called me that word, I had to ask him, is that the best you got? And laughed in his face. I'm trying to tell you, listen, when you don't give people that energy, people look stupid in the face. Say, what up, Willie from the Hub and the White Team out of St. Louis, Missouri, Southside in the building. Willie Fifth Ward, Houston, Texas up in this bit. That's what's happening. Say, I bet he like to role play with her. Yeah, hey, look. whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a lot of dog and you sisters that like to be in them type of role playing, man. They like to be slaves and shit. Mammies and shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's cute. It's cute. <laughs> They like to rope around their neck and all that fly shit. Get asphyxiated. Big word. Yeah. It makes some orgasm. It's online. Do a Google search. Yeah, they role play that slave and master. Yeah. Everybody, everybody racist unless buying spicy Popeye's chicken sandwiches. Hell no. Nah. So y'all mad just getting this notification. Shreveport is in the building. Appreciate y'all for being here. Say, did she break the bank? Mmm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That's what's up. Man, listen. I'm going to go ahead and let y'all slide, man. Um, Please go to the Patreon, the Willie Williams Show. I got a new one up there. 
for those of you who haven't saw it yet, shout out to Claudette for the two ninety nine super chat. Say she was living the American dream. Yes, sir. Say Vegas missed that section. Chocolate, where that towel at? <laughs> That's what's up. The 804 Virginia is with me. That's what's happening. The 803 is in the house. That's what's up. Listen, man, I'm going to let y'all go ahead on and get to it, man. I had I enjoyed my little time with you guys. I appreciate y'all for showing up and showing out every time a player go live, man. Even though YouTube be around here bullshitting and fake. You know what I'm saying? But they ain't going to start the goddamn show because the player still going to do what the player going to do. And, um... Watch 23, 23.69, and maybe, maybe when we're dealing with different hue people, just ask them straight out, are you racist? And the uh, number one answer will be, oh, no. You never know. Sometime I tell a situation may arise, and then you see somebody true colors that go with every hue. It don't need much matter. But y'all be careful out there. And listen, for all of y'all that's out there hunching races and stuff, if it was good for you, find out. <laughs> It'll be good after you find out. Keep doing what you're doing to live your best life. You know what I'm saying? Stop crying. Appreciate y'all. Mississippi in the house. I'm out.